Creating a simplified TS file using R or Python is relatively simple. Using the step-by-step -step directions in this guide, I'm going to create a simplified TS file for a non-clinical study, and I'll be using R. So I'll start with the appropriate packages already installed. In particular, I'll be using the SAS export package. So the first step in R is under the file menu to select new script. The second step is to copy and paste the code from the guide into the editor window or the script. So I'm going to copy and then paste. And then this third step is to edit the appropriate information in the text that we just pasted. So first, I'm going to remove the information with the hashtags. It isn't necessary, but it simplifies things. And there's four data elements that we can edit. The study ID, TSPARM CD, TSVAL, and TFL NF. So we'll start with the study ID. Study ID is XYZ123. Let's say that matches my STF file. So I'm going to leave that for the purposes of this example. Just Parm CD indicates that this is for a non-clinical study. So I will leave that the same as well. For TSVAL, for my study start date, I need to enter a real study start date. And you can see that from the copy and paste, we're missing a dash. So we'll add that in. For the year, I'll put 2011. And the study start date, we'll say, is January 1st, 2011. Now, since I have a study start date, I don't need a TSVAL NF value of NA. So I will remove that. The data label information, we don't need to edit this. The only thing that we need to edit is where this file will be saved when it's generated. So for me, I'm going to remove the word file from the file folder because my file folder is just simplified TS. And when it saves, it'll save the file simply ts.xpt. So now our first step is simply to execute this code. So we do so, do so by going to edit and clicking run all. And you see it run in the console window. And so now if we go to this file location, we should see a ts.xpt file. And our ts.xpt file is here. So we will open it up and check that the information in the file is correct. Our study ID is XYZ123. TSPARM CD value is correct. And our study start date is January 1st, 2011. And our TS Val and F value is blank because we removed the NA. Now, if we were to instead use TS Val and F of NA and, and not include a study start date, we can do that as well. I'm going to close the file. And we're going to put NA as a TSL and F value. And then to remove the study start date, we're going to remove this information and simply have 
quotation marks with nothing inside. So now if we execute the code again by running all, we can check that a new file was saved. And that file just overwrote our other file. And now we have a file, a simplified TS file with TS val and F of NA and the study start date blank. And that's it. That's how you can create a simplified TS file.